I was sat in it for a little bit and I was saying, let me in the box. Let me say my piece. Let me talk about the situation because my name's getting dragged through the dirt here. Let me talk about it. And Pearl, Pearl had the puppet master. Oh, should I like call my cousin? You are silly. Let's play. Let's play. I'll react. I'll talk about what's happened. I'll get my say into it. It's on my platform, in it. So there's no one going to be like, oh, you do that. I'll, I'll just say it as it is. And we'll see if evil evil king comes out. Or it's just going to be karma kaz. People seem to walk over karma kaz a little bit. Let's see, see what the future holds, eh? I know she is. We should see my dog. My dog's called Tramp. I'll get my wife to sleep <laughs> in to be Tramp. He's actually called Tramp. I'm already late. We'll let He's you in. Hi, little Dom. How are you? Hi, Donna. Oh, well, there's Connie. Top girl, because it says yeah. If Pearl, if you are watching now, if you are come to in, if you were sat with your Ten Commandment tablet, watching me in. S H or S D quality, the lowest of the low. You are watching me on 360 quality on your Ten Commandment tablet. I do have a theme tune for you, and only for you. I will play that theme tune now. Let me find it in my Ten Commandments. Uh, here we go. Just for you, Pearl. <laughs> Pearls FIP That's all you get in Pearl. Oh, that Kamikaze is playing music about me again. Deal with it. Yeah, and then you I started saying a load of other shit. Why? I think I'm two and five. It's Karma's perception mm. on it looking. <laughs> it is pink. Oh, don't start. I like Karma Kaz, but I don't. I don't. When I seen when no when I, I did, but then when I seen him last night talking about us, I'm like. Yeah, I'm not watching that. No, listen, it's each to the own. Everybody, it's like, I don't like people. Listen, you absolute flip-flop. What's this person's name here? Keza FYP News. What the hell are you talking about? You have just seen that you can have a place on someone else's FYP channel or FYP Live. You, you've seen an opportunity to be able to get a bit of, as everyone says, clout in the boxes. Now, if you kiss arse in this environment of Pearl's Box, you know that you're going to get invited up to Pearl's Box again. You realise that I do not have boxes. So you are not going to get any sort of positive shout out from me, unless you've done something positive. You are not going to sit in a box and gain from a situation there. So you saying because of what I said last night, I didn't even say anything bad. You've not even seen Evil King yet. I did not say anything bad. If I said anything bad, I'd wear it. I'd remember it, but I don't. So you, my friend, have been welcomed to the block list. <laughs> you are on the block list. Good luck. People who other people don't like. You can't yes. talk that. But what I'm saying is, I didn't know Karma Kaz didn't have a fucking clue who he was, right? Then all these videos was coming out about us, and I was thinking, who the fuck's this Karma Kaz? Yeah. Um, and then he was waiting for me and Luke, the judge, to go in his life one night. And I thought, what, what does he think I'm going to jump in that life for? Like, tell me what is the... The reasoning for that, I don't know the man. I've never had anything to do with him and I don't like him. Right, correction, okay. Yes, I was waiting. 
I was waiting for Pearl and Luke to join the live. Not join my box, just join the live. Simply be a viewer in the live. I don't want you to join my box, Pearl. Do not worry about that. I only brought your name up because you were being a racist. That's all. Not because I'm a fan. Not because I agree with what you say. Not because I want your clout. No, 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 no. <laughs> Merely because you popped up on my radar. That's all, Pearl. So, congratulations. You've made yourself look at tit again. Rally point. Wait a second. I can't stay awake long enough because of these boys. Yeah. I've never watched him, Pearl. Oh, no, not Nana. Oh, hi, Nana. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. All right, you had a good day, Pearl? I have. It's been oh, cool. um, like a busy one. Hello. Yeah, it's been good. And I did close up a little bit early because I'd. Uh, it was just left there. Somebody's left. I so love I you, Dad, or something. Uh, I'm going to jump up and I'm going to back the baby. I'll be back. Yeah, I'm just coming back. And listen. Understand this. Before this, before this carries on, if... If I was doing this solely for clout, solely for clout, I would have worn the Evil King crown from day one. I would have gone savage from day one. Understand that. I know what generates views. I know any publicity, bad or good, is going to generate views in a live. I have not come on an ear and like a crazy... Spartacus man calling everyone every name under the sun because trust me let's be honest I'm trying to follow the guidelines here if there was no guidelines okay I'd destroy a lot of people on it a lot of people I'm trying to do this in a constructive way okay I'm trying to politely move through the app Move and groove. More grooving than moving sometimes. I will call people out that I've done wrong. I'll try and help victims of these wrongdoers. I try and speak on a level where everyone understands me a bit. But I'm constantly getting drawn out. Constantly. I'm getting drawn out by these people. They're not asked about what awareness I'm trying to bring. They're not seeing that. Fuck that, eh? Fuck awareness, right? That's what they think. Why aren't you going after this person? Why aren't you going after that person? Not asked about that. They're just asked about who I am and what, what my agenda is, apparently. Apparently I'm on here for the leaderboards. <laughs> yeah, all right. I'd be the first person in the world to get on the rankings, only coming live at 10.30 till 2 in the morning. What what sort of game plan would that be for me? Hey, come on at 10.30. Come on, guys, we can do it. What is it everyone does? Ah! <laughs> 10.30. Yeah, you're wrong. Let's carry on watching, because I'm starting to sweat on my back. Get plenty of consoling because I can I can hear in your voice is trembling. You're a good therapist. And the Bella's just called me out as well, guys. She wants to bother me, but tell her that after I've had the child, I will come. I'm going to drop down and just double check that she's okay. I don't want to be an upset. Thanks, exactly. Who's going to go um, do a check on her? Very emotional. Just before we carry on with this as well, I want to shed I want to shed some light on the actual situation. I want to shed some light on why I posted the video I did why I constructed what DG had said into a song. Um, firstly, I was asleep at the time. I had a lie-in this morning, because I can. And while I was having a lie-in, I think Charlie or someone, someone who does an FYP, I could get some names wrong here, but what has happened is correct. I think it was a guy called Charlie who does an FYP thing in the morning. 
Charlie was talking about DG in some situation. DG come, went in the box. Now, without offending anyone, trigger warning, whatever, I know Charlie has people in his life who are disabled or not, how do you say it politely, not able, disabled, not able, same thing in it. There was people or a person in the live who was disabled. There may have been more than one. And the way people speak, so you find with people that are not necessarily uneducated, but people who struggle with certain things in life. It could be education, but it can be other things. They might talk like they might say, um, after everything, like, um, I don't know, um, what to say, um, or they might talk in a way which isn't really like molded together properly. So the sentences might sound a bit different or they might not be able to get the words out, whatever. Okay. There's, there's loads of different levels to it. Um, but yeah, there was people in that live which suffered from that okay so verbally they weren't 100 percent. so from my knowledge on this situation what happened dg joined this fyp uh, live discussed a subject i don't know which way it went whether it went dg's way or their way i don't know but what i do know is after that fyp live he then went live himself and discussed how people in these fyp boxes uh, don't have a brain or I don't know the terminology he was using pr properly but what he was trying to get at is that I think he was using words like simple people are a bit simple upstairs or similar to that and then he moved on he moved on then to what my video was so I because I didn't want the video to go over a minute because I didn't want people to be like oh you're trying to profit off this so my video is like 51 seconds or something. So I cropped it at the point where he started doing what I thought and what a lot of people think is very disrespectful. Imitating someone who has a disability, making fun out of how they talk, as well as doing actions which might replicate someone who has cerebral palsy or someone who has another issue with the limbs or the way just the way the mannerisms are okay so he imitated that and i thought a way of spreading awareness on this situation so other people do not think this is a correct thing to do and other people might think that they can get away with it because dg's done it what i thought would be correct is to take the part which i thought was the most concerning and turn it into a song and you might be thinking you're sick why are you turning it into a song what you find on this app a lot of information is spread on the app and a lot of people talk about a lot of stuff so if you've heard six or seven things in the morning off watching videos and it's just verbal stuff or it might be a clip or something you're not going to retain information after about five six or seven videos you're going to start forgetting it or it's going to start getting shaded so if you start turning things into like um you start adding things to music for example uh, music's a really good way of getting a point across because you remember a song and if if you align the verbal part with the backing track correctly when you remember a song, you remember the words as well. So if I add this situation into a song, people are going to digest it better. People are going to understand it. There's going to be people that wouldn't uh, retain the information just from an informal video, which will retain the information by seeing it as a song. Okay, so that's where we're at with that. So DG had gone into an FYP page where people did have disabilities. And after it, he did his own live and he talked about how the people in the boxes was was simple. And then he went on to do some verbal stuff with some mannerisms, which everyone knows what it is. Like if you do it in your spare, in your free time at home or something, it's, it's totally different than if you do it on a platform 
when you have a big following. If you have influence, you have to be careful what you do. I've made mistakes in the past. I've made loads of mistakes on this app in the past. And a time when I didn't have any influence, that doesn't make it correct. But once you start getting to a point where you have a little bit of influence, that's when you need to start thinking, I can't do this because if I do this, a lot of other people are going to think this is correct to do. So like from now or from last week or from whenever I started getting some traction off the back of EQ, obviously, I I then understand that there's certain things I can't say or do because that might make it seem acceptable for other people. Okay, so he should have learned, he should know the position he's in, he should understand this. All I want from this situation is DG to apologize. Not to me, don't have to mention my name, I'm nothing to do with this. Remember, I'm a no one. I'm an absolute no one. I'm just a vessel. I'm a vessel which talks about stuff. Someone inboxes me about something and I think it's creditable, or if I see something on FYP, I'll talk about it. I am just a vessel. I'm an absolute no one. I have no clout. I have no clout. I do not make thousands off the app. I don't I'm not I'm not the same as these other creators. I don't care if he's apologizing to me. I'm not bothered. I'm doing this video for the people that it's affecting. So all I want from this situation is DG to say sorry for it and it's not a correct thing to do just in order, just so other creators, smaller ones, and ones at the same level, understand that it's not acceptable to do this on a live. Okay, I'm going to continue playing. On that. I like, we need, her. you need to get DG, you know, I like DG, and I don't want people to think DG's being, you know, bullying disabled kids when he's well, not. Well, that's I what I'm saying, because yeah, he's I I love DJ, DJ, so I do. I can anybody share to DG? Yeah, you know what was going on with Lisa Marie? And you not, shared that because you're it looks like you believe it. No, it's not that I believe it. I'm putting it out there because I'm an FYP page. I'm supposed to... It's rude to that. So th this, this FYP page, what she called Keza FYP, like, she, what she's just said then... Because she, she reposted my video, or she repo she reposted something which was the clip. Okay, I know her attentions when she posts that because she's an FYP FYP news channel that does post stuff out there. She's wanting the views. Okay, she's wanting the views, so she needs to be unbiased, impartial. She needs to just post stuff. I think she originally posted this thinking, DG, you've done wrong here. And she's then seen that DG's people are in this live, okay? And they're all, pro DG, yeah, you've not done anything wrong. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And she's jumped up now, flip-flopped, and thought, yo, I want to be part of this group. <laughs> These are the group for me. Pearl gets 3.8 thousand people in when... Um, when DG's in the box or someone is in the box. This is for me. I can capitalize on this with my views and stuff. Flip flop. Don't ever put any of my recordings on your page again. Just one of his play Very simple. I, uh, I, don't yeah, I, I don't believe DJ because what. Uh, Oh, butterfly. What he's doing here, this the, the accent and stuff, and the butterfly thing. I don't think that is that bad. That isn't the worst part of it. If he would have just done that, that's that is what it is, isn't it? Like it's like it's frowned upon, but he's trying to do it in a comedic manner, and sometimes comics. I'm not saying he's funny. <laughs> I'm definitely not saying DG's funny. But comics will say stuff or do stuff and get away with certain stuff because it could be portrayed as being funny. Granted, to a younger audience, but it could be portrayed to be funny. Okay, so this isn't the worst part. 
that if he just did this, I wouldn't have picked up on it because he, he's done loads of stuff like this in the past, which is just borderline. And borderline, if you're doing it in a comedic way, then you can't really say it sounds bad, but you can't really, you can't do anything about it, can you? You can't, you, there's nothing you can do. It was this event. It was all and simple. I don't believe DJ because. Um, like, you know, like exposed and that. But I still believe in it. Um, he was calling them uh, simple. I'm a commute. I know this is going to sound bad. The, the people who went in and sort of like understood and were like, all right, okay, sounded rather intelligent. So that just shows to me, I sat there and two people went in a box and were like, no, I sort of, I don't believe it's this, I don't believe it's that. And, I, you know, and I, even they didn't fully agree with me, but they agreed in that it wasn't cockapoo and whatever else. And they said, but, you know, I think people are now trying to take it and trying to clutch at it. And they sounded rather intelligently spoken, very well spoken and very uh, articulate. Whereas in the other... Uh, 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 Okay. The, so from now, this this is where I deem it too far. When I see in the video, when I see in the recording, obviously this is the whole recording. I started my video from here because this is where I deemed it too far. Okay. So if I'm showing the build up, it doesn't fucking matter. Let's be honest, it doesn't matter what he said beforehand, it doesn't matter what he did beforehand, the, the issue is these 30 seconds now, okay? So for people saying I've cropped this as like a, as a dick, I say, oh, I'm going to get it back, you cropped it. Yeah, damn right I cropped it. Damn right I cropped it, because there's no fucking excuse for doing this. I don't want to hear someone's excuse for doing it. You've done it. You know how TikTok works. As you keep saying, you've been on air a couple of years, okay? You understand what's right, what's wrong, okay? You understand the mechanics of a live, okay? You know exactly what you're doing. The problem is... And I said this, I said this, I can't remember, it's last night, the night before, whenever I said it. But I fought it for quite a bit now. You are falling off, DG. And I don't want you to be boycotted off the app. Believe it or not, I don't want your channel to be gone. I don't want any harm to come to you off the app. I don't want, I, I'm not this, this Martha after you. Okay, but you keep coming into my realm and you shouldn't be. You should not be coming into this realm. If you are as big as you say you are and you've got a big following where you've got 1.5k to 2k in your live, just do your fucking shit. Just do it. Continue doing what you're doing. Go away. Have fun trips. Right, do your lives. Do your funny stuff. Stop. Stop coming down. If you think I'm a no one and you don't like these FYP pages, stay up there. Stay up there where you're safe. Because what's happened now with you saying you're doing a 10.30 live, you, you did a video saying you're doing a 10.30 FYP page. That was a dig at me. I'm not stupid. I understand it. If I'm that much of a no one, or if I'm not a threat to you, why on your big platform with all your viewers why do you feel the need to then collide times with me you've, you've clearly got an agenda on it clearly got an agenda you've made a very very bad mistake a very bad mistake joining fyp boxes is a bad mistake for you you shouldn't be doing it doing fyp news at 10 30 or any time you should not be doing that that that's do what you want, but you should not be doing that. Your channel is not based on FYP. You have run out of content. You have run out of content. You were up here, and if you think I'm here or down... I started off down here. I think I'm about here now, okay? And you're up here. What you've done is you've come down here saying you're doing an FYP page, 
and you've brought yourself down to my level now. Okay, and in doing that, you've brought yourself down to the level of every FYP page now. So you are going into boxes and you're fucking up. You're going into boxes and you're ruining DG as a brand by doing so. That's the problem. It's no one else to blame apart from yourself. No one to blame apart from yourself and what's happening. And you have these yes men. You have these yes men around you. Pearl, Angie. Other, there's others. They're not worth saying what their names are. There's others. And they will not allow you to do any wrong in people's eyes. But you're doing wrong. Your ego... The problem is your ego has taken over your thinking power. When we all come on here, we don't have an ego. We go on, we think about stuff, we orchestrate stuff, we, we do lives, and it's all great. You start getting the numbers in, your ego grows. Your brain's here, your ego's... Your ego's through the fucking roof. And I don't think you know what to do when someone tickles your ego. I think that is why you've come down to this level. You cannot bear to see someone else get views on their channel. You cannot bear to see the truth coming out about stuff. You will do everything in your power. As I've seen on a video where you said you've contacted TikTok and they're, they're going to start taking FYP pages down. You are not happy that other people are growing on the app. I've seen it with that Dead Wings or whatever it's called. I've seen it there. I've seen it with loads of other people. As soon as someone gets a bit of a boost which could change their life, you get worried. You have to sabotage it some way. You have to sabotage it. And you've got this team of yes men around you, which are just blowing smoke up your ass all the time. And it's not correct. It is not correct. You are going to be your own downfall, not me, you. Okay, I'll point out, I'll highlight stuff you do wrong. If I think it's going to affect someone, I'll highlight it. Because by highlighting it, I'm bringing awareness to the situation. I'm helping other people out so they, one, don't do what you're doing, and two, don't fall under the bus because of what you've done. You do every action from here, okay? It's not my problem that your ego's up here, all right? That's it. Bye. Three. Nice having four. <laughs> I can count ten. EQ Army, how's it going? Evil yeah. Queen, if you're in here, how's it going? Fuck off. So. Penguins. Can I just make a point quickly, Pearl, if you don't mind? Right, what? people need to realise if I post videos, it's not that I believe it. I've never given my opinion on videos when I post them. I'm an FYP and post to post videos about. When, you know when people do things, it's what yeah. I'm supposed to do, and I'm an FYP news, what do you expect? Yes, because when I followed her back, she went, what did you say to us in a message? I'm very shocked at that. I'm, yeah, I'm shocked you're following me. Because... So what you've got here, um, this, I'm, I don't want to discredit any FYP news channels, and because I, I, I'm, pro, I'm pro for them. I'm pro for, don't ruin someone's life, but... If you want to highlight an issue which has happened or a positive thing which has happened, great, have the channel, do what you're doing. This person now, this Keza FYP, is now under control. She is now under control. It's as simple as that. Everything she posts from now on is going to be biased. If there's a situation with Pearl, Angie, DG, Luke when he gets back, Miss Red when she comes back, any of them, Mark my words, mark my words, this lady here, Keza, is going to put stuff out which is it's just going to be biased. Biased bullshit. Biased bullshit. BBC News there. BBC News. I'll remind you of that in a couple of weeks when something comes out, eh? Listen, if people post things about me, it's not no whatever. 
No, it's not. Whilst about it, so what? It doesn't make them a bad person or anything. That's what people oh. need to understand. It's not that I agree or disagree what DG is saying or doing. Yeah. It's I'm FYP, I'm supposed to post things. So that's what people need to understand. So don't think I'm supporting them or not supporting them. Uh, someone's mentioned you was defending him a minute ago. I defend. I I will say I can't see DG mocking dis disabled people. I, I've just so, said yeah, I will say. It. And then I saw her face. Now oh, I'm a believer. <laughs> So she's posted something where someone's blatantly mocking disability. Okay, so it doesn't take an Einstein to think, okay, he's mocking disability, this is wrong. What she's done with her biased FYP page is for, oh, it's DG. Let's get some points. I can't see anything wrong with it. Good, good, uh, good news channel you got there. Good news channel. I hope, I hope it does really well for you and I wish you all the best. But I won't be fucking watching. In that video and it's not on. It's definitely not on. I don't agree with that, no. Yeah. And if he comes in, I'll say the same to him. If he's watching, I'll say the same to him. I do not agree with that. What? You were defending a minute ago and said it wasn't what it was. Yeah, I don't think he's mocking disabled people. Again, it's my opinion. You don't have to agree or disagree with what I'm saying. I can't have Listen, <laughs> I'm going to educate. Um, if, if anyone has an FYP channel there, I, I get you clued up. You know what you're doing. It's a hobby. It's a passion. You know what you're doing. She has made a crucial mistake. A crucial mistake. And I'll tell you why. She has said, it's my opinion. Okay. Okay, do you ever, when you're watching TV, go on a news channel and the, the news presenter is like, oh, uh, some, something's happened today in XYZ country, uh, X amount of people have been whatevered, but in my opinion, it's all right. <laughs> now to the weather. Do you, do you ever... Do you, <laughs> that is madness. Yeah, I've got an FYP news channel, but in my opinion, it's fine. Keep your fucking opinions to yourself about that. I have my opinion. My my child is disabled and has special needs. Uh, yeah. But I cannot see him there coming across like he's mocking disabled people. Or, do you know what I'm saying? Somebody said, why was Top Girl crying? Because she's that clip that they showed then was literally the first 10 seconds. I will play the actual clip now on my phone. I don't know whether you're going to... Can you see my screen? You can see it right. Perfect. I'm going to get... I'm going to get the song up on my channel. I'm not plugging it, but I'm going to get it up because it does have the full part of it. Um, let me have a look. Let me turn it up a bit. Oh. I can't see. Hang on. Can't see it. Seven four. I can count ten. Yeah. I can't get it up. What he's doing, like the facial things. Listen, anyway, the proof's in the pie. The video's there. There's other videos of it out there. Don't let this, this opinionated presenter um, tell you any different off a 10-second video there. Just being bullied in Canadian Andy's life, that's why. I think you should know better by now. The baby saw so stress levels is over the top and um, emotion, and all because 
two mods for me. So they called it out for being um, being my mod, saying she enables racism, um, saying all nasty things to her. So shame on them. Shame on them. A lot of people in here actually think DG was mocking. The only thing that can be done is DG needs to come in and defend himself. Exactly, exactly. And somebody has shared it to him if he comes in. Yeah, to it sounds to DG. I mean, end of the day, everybody's having their opinion in the comments. And just because we're in the box. Anyone who uses at the end of the day in the sentences, take you with a pinch of salt, people. It doesn't mean oh, we can't have our opinion. Listen as well, do a poll. Let's wait and see if he comes in. Get your own point to him. I don't know how. I, I don't know what you're on about, but whatever. Well, the only way to hear how that was is coming from the horse's mouth, literally. But if, if that's I'm not saying he was intended like that. Comes it doesn't come. Across, it doesn't look very nice. Yeah, and I do agree. It doesn't look nice. very. It doesn't look nice very nice. And I yeah. didn't agree with it. Yeah. I can see it doesn't look very nice. I can see what people are saying now. So instead of Pearl, like, taking on board that it's incorrect what he's done, taking some sort of moral high ground and saying, you need to apologise for this, this does not look good. She's just said, she's just said, well, it doesn't, doesn't look great, DG. It doesn't look great. But if you want to, if you want to jump in the box and uh, <laughs> talk for yourself, say what happened. I'm going to allow you to say what you want, regardless whether it's pro, pro making the situation better or not. I'm just going to let you up here because I'm Pearl, Pearly Willy. <laughs> I'm, I'm reading the comments. I can see what people are, 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 yeah. are explaining. But the reason I'm saying it didn't seem it to me so because you can have a baby. Like a person. He's got nice children and did just having thing. another baby, Nikita. Thank Thank you, Chester. Chester. That's how much they know about things. All they know is what they're the, on the little gossip platform is what um, is happening right in front of them because they run with everything. So they don't know anything nice one, about mate. Top Girl. Yeah. All you yeah. knew was she was my mod. Shame on them. Honest, proper bullies at the highest level. Um, true. He was mocking disabled people. Someone else was tagging me again. You sound like another Cray on here, but I can't think of her name. Oh, do I? That's let me know her. He was calling the trolls thick. That's all. They saying he was calling the trolls thick. That's what I said. If he comes on, let him explain it himself. Yeah. I think he's... Because as long as I have... That's made, true. I mean, I'm in, I'm in sort of people think that's how disabled, disabled people are. Look how many times somebody will come and say this to me, things to me, and I'll say, no, it was your mother. And then I got bananaed once for saying, no, that was your mother, and I can't come out with the rest of the comment because I got bananaed for a week for it. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. And that was back at the trolls. The trolls only get you into lots of trouble. Why yeah. was he talking like that? I don't know. This is what I'm yeah. saying. I, yeah. And that's I what I said. What people he comes on and comes and, and says it how it is. But think about as well what DG does. That's exactly what DG does. All them things. So I am not. If it was like that, I'd wrong, right? But what I'm saying is let DG come and explain himself. Because like stands for everything that's good and this is why I'm very very confused yeah notice notice when you on my door. how these people are tiptoeing round subjects Early this morning. notice the arse kissing which is happening you have awakened a monster here. I have been nice from day one. I've been polite. I've been everything I needed to be. Changed. Changed today. Good fucking luck. That's all I'm going to say moving forward. Good fucking luck. Evil King is here. 
so barely worthy. More on that later. Let's see what this this line. When's is the box in hell? It's uh, not this Friday coming, the Friday after. Is it the 6th or the 7th of uh, June? So I'm looking forward to it. You're excited, aren't you? Kate has booked our rooms. So I've got a trip room. So I said to Angie if she wanted to come. So she hasn't got a room. Are you posting it if you have no clue? I post it because my thing on here is FYP. That is why I post things. Because at the time, a lot of people are talking. If people are talking about certain clips and hit, it wouldn't it be partly so I didn't post it? Because I have to post it. Well, like I say, if he comes in, he'll answer, Teresa. He'll answer to whoever. But till... Listen, we all see clips of... Someone's just said in the comments, I cannot be evil, King, because I have a quiff. Listen. Listen, my young apprentice. This quiff has enabled me to get multiple inboxes per day from the opposite sex, telling me how much I look like David Beckham or Tom Cruise. So take a screenshot of this quiff, and next time you go to your barbers, ask for the quiff. The quiff is life. The quiff is life. things on here and it's caused absolute riots on here and when you've got to the full story i don't know how many times i've ag argued with people over things and when you've got to the full story it hasn't been like that at all so can, can, can i ask a question miss Taylor? was there any context behind uh, before that part that you recorded and um put up in order for him to be no see that clip is in my clip that isn't my clip. That's why I've not put my look picture on it because it's not mine. I only put pictures of me on it when it's my clip. So I took that clip and posted it on my page because at the time that was, um, everybody was talking about it in the comments. I had to do some searches to find it and I posted it on my page because obviously I'm FYP. So I'm not saying I defend him or I disagree with him. Like I'm saying, it doesn't come across good. But it's weird to think DG of mocking people. That's what I'm saying. Because he stands for so much about that. Yeah, that's what I'm very again. surprised. This is what I'm trying to say. DG, right? Listen, listen. DG does a lot for charities behind the scenes without coming on. Listen, you pillock. If, if I am a paramedic and I spend my days helping the wounded, the people in need. But then in the evenings, I cause people to be wounded. Does that make it right? Am I then exempt? Ask yourself that, Pearl. DG gives money to charity for disabled people. But he's come on and mocked disabled people. But it's even, right? <laughs> That's how it goes, isn't it? If you ever want to commit a crime, honestly, I'm going to say this here. If you ever want to commit a crime, just do some charity work beforehand for it. Sponsor a bank or something for a month prior, then roll up with a 12 gauge. See you later. It's fine. Won't go to prison because <laughs> you sponsored the bank. What, what sort of shit are you spurring out? your 5 p.m. platform. If I worked a nine to five and I knew Pearl's Live started at five, I'd do fucking overtime. I would go back to work and put in the hours. Anything, voluntary work, just so I didn't have to lay eyes on you and listen to this. Yes, I brought you into my realm, but I certainly will not be sucked into your realm. You're saying I've done this, done that. That's why I'm shocked. I really am shocked. Yeah. But like I say, I, I, I post it from another page. It's Clip King, I think it is. So I post because it's, it's news. 
everybody has been talking about it on the app today, so that's Listen, why I know he mocks people with accents, but we all do, right? We all do that. Um, and Can I can't... just um, jump in and say, say one thing? I give maybe about 15% of my wages every month to charity. It doesn't mean I'm a good person. It's part of our salary. Exactly. It's a part of my religion. It doesn't mean I'm a good person. I'm, I'm the most violent person in the I can see, no, I have gave for years and I would never ever cancel direct debits to certain charities, right? I'd yeah. never ever cancel them. But that's nothing to do with my religion or anything. Plus, we go out and we do lots of things, what nobody ever sees, because I think if you come on here and you say, look what I've done, I've gone out and I've helped this homeless or I've fed that person or I've given this person money, it's making yourself look big-headed. So you don't do that. If you do a good deed, it's silent. And it's... Cause it's silent, but like when you do a bad deed, <laughs> silence, right? Right, is this, is this what we're working by now on the app, is it? Do a good deed, then you can do a bad deed, do a good deed, then a bad deed. Reality check, that is not how it works. That is not how it works. Really? Hi, Chelsea. But that's what I'm yeah. saying, um, Pearl. Like, it doesn't mean, like, because people are doing stuff. Um, sorry, one minute. <laughs> You okay, Top Girl? No, I didn't realise that either. Um, that certain people get out of them. Um, we have like to. It's, it's, it's part of our religion, but it doesn't mean we're good people. We do it because of our religion. Do you know what I mean? But uh, forget the religion stuff. I'm just saying, it doesn't mean that you're a good person just because um, you give um, give to charities or you do things um, via charities. Like he's vile. He said. Um, stuff about his shower spitting at him like African and water which is yes, wrong. I heard that I heard um, that right. yeah he's done like looking at that even the context behind it he's mocking people I have seen it and that's what I'm saying like it's um, how long does it take for DG to jump in this you have to ask him and then it come out of his mouth how that was because we all know when things get cut and I don't agree with it Definitely none. I've got a little nephew who's got to, had to go down and have brain surgery to have things in because he had lots of problems. And then even for his hearing, born deaf, and he's a big lump of a lad now and learning to talk. Yes. You know what I'm saying? No, so, yeah. I mean, her, like, when the like thing this. is, her, you know what? Like, you need to, when you see something, you need to just take Another it as you've seen minutes. it, not people giving you Should we skip justification to the DG for it part or an stay excuse on this? for the behaviour. Because, I like, don't, I don't agree with it. If that's how it was, I, one million percent, I don't agree with it. Not little um, innocent babies. Skip, De skip. No, definitely not. Like, it's. Angie. Angie. Hi, guys. Are you guys talking about DG? Yeah, yeah you've seen it. We're talking about that clip that's you watched it live or not. I have not seen it. Has it been another clip? Oh, come on, show it. Show Angie. <laughs> Angie, I have not seen it. All right, Angie, of course you haven't. <laughs> oh. Do you please? Hold on. Angie, I've just been bullied because of you, Van Pearl. Get out of here. It's Canadian Angie, the biggest bully platform <laughs> on it yet. Oh, no, he's he's not Oh, here we go, here we they go. They agreed in that it was been bullied because of you and Pearl. Uh, uh, I don't believe DJ because what a... Uh... Sounding simple. Oh, Evil Queen jumped. Hi, I didn't realise Evil Queen jumped in the box. Because he says sounding oh, simple and then does all oh, these sorry, uh, that that's a simple I didn't hear that. DJ because um, basically uh, the facts that they put up are facts. Uh, I've... Oh. And then the people who went in and sort of like understood and were like, all oh, right, okay, sounded rather intelligent. So that just shows to me, I sat there and two people went in the box and were like, no, I sort of, I don't believe it's this, I don't believe it's that. And, I, you know, and I, even they didn't fully agree with me, but they agreed in that it wasn't cockapoo and whatever else. And they said, but, you know, I think people are now trying to take it and trying to clutch at it. And they sounded rather intelligently spoken, very well spoken and very, uh, 
articulate, whereas in the other one I do. Okay. Um, I pray. This is a father, guys. Uh, I can count ten. Yeah. Fuck off. I just say something, Phil. I, I don't. Uh, I didn't hear that just, bit at the beginning. I just quickly say something. I mean, okay, it sounds like it's mocking, but I think I think many, many people have, have, have acted like that. Okay, so what? the elusive Angie has done there she's acknowledged that he is mocking a disability guess what's come out next but now people go on to the but part of subjects when they are either teamed up with that person they have a biased opinion on the situation or they're just trying to throw him a get out of jail free card he was in, uh, what's the word mimicking uh, whatever the word is someone who's disabled but let's listen to the book part off TikTok let's not let's not uh, lie I think the majority of people are, are pretty simple on here anyway do you know what I mean I'm not going to lie and um, can I just say one thing I'm... so Angie's just agreed that most of the people on the FYP pages are simple anyway so what she's done is she's acknowledged it's bad she's done a book then she's agreed with what she's just said is bad in a way which aligns with what he said. Most people are simple. And now she's going to go forth. Finish. DJ, I got my bed at 8 o'clock. Please come and gift me. I've, I've oh had my- and that's her intentions. That's her intentions. She finished with DG, I have a battle at 8 p.m. Please come and gift me. Now that might come over as a joke, but there's intention in that. His intention and this Angie is the same person who does the lives every day, gets people in the boxes, ruins lives. Literal Al I V E S lives while doing a live. <laughs> is this who you want to host your lives? Is it he who gifts the most will get the benefit of the doubt? God, what? Thank you, Hell. When I'm sick, yeah. You made a statement just a few minutes ago, which is why I joined the box, and you said DG does a lot for people off the app that he doesn't tell anybody about. So how do you know if he doesn't tell anyone? Just I've heard other people saying this was nice, what this was done, and that and that. He hasn't. I don't talk to DG. I've just how I hear things, so that's how I know things has been done. Yeah, hearsay, babes. So yeah, DG, he, he DG's not. in the wrong and where's Evil Queen in the box? Can I just say something though? Yeah, I you honestly you along, think, guys. Can, I, can I just quickly say this? I honestly think he's just taking the piss. He's having a laugh. I think a lot of people have kind of acted like that off it's TikTok. A good person, normally. Also, yeah. I think a lot. Can I just say it, please? Well, because it's hard to make believe this when I'm watching then. this because yeah, but you're always. Do you know in life you get people that infiltrate certain businesses, um, certain situations, uh, um, educational premises. They'll infiltrate it. So they'll go in, they'll be the nice guy. (laughs) I'm nice, I do charity, I do this. The next day they're coming in strapped up and they're on the front of the news. There's a police chopper above filming it. But they're a nice guy, right? (laughs) They're a nice guy. That's how it works, isn't it? Interrupting what I'm saying. No, I'm saying he's a father himself, so he's not going to mock a child or anything, is he? Yeah, he's just he's just taking the mick a little bit. A lot of people, I think he's taking control. People Maybe. bring up two occasions where he drops some food after a food bank. You just you know we just talk over people. So talk over people. You know I'm going to say something here. There there was um again there was a clip or four clips. It was clipped up. There was a live I did a few months back. And it was clipped up into four segments. In this live, I said that um, I'm going to take it all and I'm going to go for the leaderboards. Okay. Before that, which they didn't show, bear in mind, before that, I'd lost my access to the creativity program on my channel, which had 170,000 followers. 
I built that channel up. I made money off that account, off views on videos. Someone sent bots in a live to my live and got me removed off the creativity program for, oh, what was it? What was the word? Uh, not false engagement, but some, some sort of basically false engagement with it and it scrapped me off it. So I fired a live up on the backup and said, I've been doing this for four years. I may as well just do the leaderboards and take everything I can get. All right, someone cropped that up, took it way out of context, made it look like I had intention, took the emotion out of it, and made it look like that is my intention of what I'm doing now. Angie picked up on it straight away. Straight away, ripped me to shreds. Pearl ripped me to shreds. DG ripped me to shreds. Luke the Judge shreds. Everyone ripped me to fucking shreds. And I merely said something in emotion, not intention. I said, I may as well take it all and do the leaderboards. And the people that fucking come at me with a... Use that to discredit me. But when something like this happens, this is an example. When something like this happens, I ain't touching that. <laughs> it's just a joke, wasn't it? It's just a joke. It's just a joke. Fuck it. It's just a joke. What world is this? Come on, Angie. It's okay. She's gone. Um. So he's done. He's done about two things on the app in the space of two well, years. Back in so, I can't be in the box. Know, any, any, anybody, oh. anybody can go to a food bank and drop one parcel of food off one time for social media cloud. Sorry, Kel, but she's never, bio. She talks about. Know, but what I'm trying to say is, I can't. Honestly, I can't stay in the same box. Well, yeah. Good down there. He does a lot. He does a lot, right? He and you can. On there, and everybody was saying he was just mocking the trolls and mocking how they were going on about. But he doesn't do a lot of him. I don't think he what? would mock a child. I really yeah. do not think he's mocking When a I child. go to the shopping centre, I give my pound to the homeless man who sits by the trolley. Is that every single time? But he's only went to the food bank once. So how does he do a lot? Well, there's no justification for that. You know either as well. I've heard different ones saying what we do. I've heard different ones saying what we do. Right, but. Jika, I'm going to put your live on after this because obviously the recording from your live, which was unbiased, is up as well. But I need people to see this first because then it paints the picture. To me, that there was going on. I wish you would just come on and have a say. No, oh, the thing is, oh. Gabriel, as well, if, if you was a child, it, him as well. It, okay, I'm you might not have been doing it to a child. How are you doing? How are you doing, doing now? Hello, disabilities. Tony. It doesn't matter if it's a child or it's an adult. It's a disability. The disability. It doesn't just affect us. Can I say something yet, Pearl? Can you can you do a poll, please? Can you do a poll? I want to see. I want to see who thinks he was marking and, and who thinks he was at marking. Right. Can you do a poll? Put a poll up. Go on top, girl. I haven't seen any of this part, so I'm just going to watch this with you guys. I get a lot of you have seen it, but I'm guessing it's only going to be five minutes and then I'll skip it. Well, now you do it. Um, one of them wants to do it because I can't do it once I'm in the box. What's the poll for? To see just who just, thinks... I want to see who thinks DG, DG didn't mean nothing by that or he was marking, marking people. I just, I just want to find out the poll. For having two peas work. Evil I the thing is that Evil Queen just mentioned, <laughs> Evil Queen just mentioned at the beginning, it said something about simple. I didn't hear that bit. Yeah, he so says. I simple. wasn't aware. So, yeah. No, I, I heard, I heard uh, the word simple. Yeah. Uh, but again. So they're all acknowledging that they've heard now the full extent of it. And Pearl's just used the uh, B U T word. So let's see, let's see what Pearl says. Uh, he, he, he was mocking, imitating how a simple person would sound like, basically. And then his words. But there's people who watch viewers who have got children who make those sounds, and that's so obviously he's offended a lot of people. Right, the polls up anyway. Share this live to DJ, please. Yeah, I've already shared it. So as, well, I think I think people are, they might be a lot of people are saying no. Well, they can say no. Everyone has their own. Pearl, you are clout chasing to the max in this situation. You are fired. 
your live up merely to kiss ass with DG. You want DG in your box so your numbers go through the roof. You are butting your way out of every which way. You know it's wrong, but you are kissing ass in order to get him in. Okay, so you are just as bad as that Tezza or Keza, FYP, whatever she's called. Opinions on it, yeah, do you know but I'm yes. Evil Queen anyway. Your friends just bullied me on their live. Can you please tell yes, us? No, I'm not telling anybody I'm responsible for myself. Um, if you tell them to unblock me so I can go. No, I'm, I'm telling, honestly, I, I'm telling nobody anything. I, yeah, I'm here and that's all that matters. You bet. No, I want to. Can I say that she's going to batter me? What girl, I'll tell your husband after you. Spending too much time online. <laughs> oh. oh, can I ask you a question? Uh, like, like you, sorry, one second. Like you mocked Molly. The hypocrisy is ridiculous. Who's mocked Molly and who is Molly? Passing, but does listen. Th this this is one of the prime examples of the problems on this app. Okay, someone could have done something in the past. Okay, they could have got the most amount of shit for it. They could have acknowledged the situation. Yeah, anything could have happened in the past. If someone does something today now, it doesn't make it correct or any better if you point saying well you did this you did that 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 long ago it doesn't give you that pass to do it think about yourself pearl think about dg on this because it's about dg okay everyone points i get numerous inboxes each day saying look into something to do with eq or look into this look into that when it's like, well, I'm looking into this at the minute, okay? If I'm bringing awareness to this subject and you're bombarding me to do something about EQ, you just, you just, you just want a downfall. You don't want any awareness to be spread. You just want a downfall out of me, and it, it's not, it's not going to work that way. Don't. Sorry, I'm just so reading some up past stuff that Evil Queen has obviously but done. But this isn't about me right now. I've, I've been done for my. Now case number 474. Yeah, we could easy. imagine Tony, somebody goes into the dock for murder and because somebody else made it before them, they're the ones like, well, somebody else did it. It wouldn't matter with it. This is about an individual crime. It's, it's, it's separate crime, right? Listen, um, look, people, I not be a funny. My opinion on this, that, that was too far. Now, I understand. Listen, I, 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 didn't have a, I don't have a problem with no one. I don't like to think I have a problem with anyone on this app. But I know DG does a lot of voice impression. There's a lot of other fun stuff on this app but that there would have triggered a lot of people mm -hmm. yeah it would have triggered a lot of people and it's not the first time he put on a filter uh, which what tony's saying here is what pearl should be saying is what this fyp t or not t sorry fyp whatever she's called should be saying he's saying what everyone should be saying which had half of his face dropped down when he was in the box with Darren, who wow. had a stroke five or six years ago. Did he or did he not do it back then? Correct. Wow. I didn't know that. He, he, he dropped, when Darren was in the box, I think his name is Darren. Sorry, yeah. I could be getting the name wrong. Yeah, there it is, Darren. And Darren got so upset, he left the live. He jumped out of it. DJ was sitting there. I've seen that video. This is not the first time he's done this. It's, oh. a, it's the second time he's done this. Right, so the poll said 55%. Um, have said yes and 44% no. Fuck the poll. Coming straight out of Compton. Listen, if that was mock and a disability, I don't agree with it on any level, any way, shape or form, because that affects me big style, right? Mm. But um, he should come in and speak for himself. Because Definitely. He needs, to, he needs to clear it. He really does. Yeah. In all honesty, what he in knows. Clear. If people feel offended, they have a right to feel offended. Just yeah, because some people's like children not... talk like that, you see, so you got to think yeah. that. That's what I'm saying, where someone might not be offended, but if someone's got a child or a family... Yeah. It's, not, it's, not just, it's not just children. There, there's plenty of people yes. 
out there. That, 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 look at that lady on here, on here in the wheelchair who went to Emmerdale and did the sea, and she makes those noises, and she's a fully grown adult. You know what exactly. Mean? So it's not just children. It, it's not just people, children. No, it's not. Why do people just get so affected? He didn't say it to a child. He said it to any fucking disabled people. I think it because he, I think I think because people were saying he's got a child, so I think it got crossed over. But yeah, he's a right. It could be against anybody. I'm leaving Listen, the box. Listen, I'm going to jump in because he has. Until you've you've had someone in your family who has, um, who's autistic or has uh, like high end of the level autism or autism autistic. I don't know if it's the same thing, but they're up there. So they do different mannerisms, and you can see that they have a heart of gold. Okay, and you can see they're a nice person, but in life they're going around and they might be getting bullied in school, they might be getting mistreated where they go. Okay, and you try your best to help that person, but you know that wherever they're going to go, they're going to get some sort of, sadly, laughter behind the back or treated a different way, and you can't do anything about that. That hurts, okay? And you bottle that up every day, okay? In the back of your head, you bottle it up and you crack on with it. But when when someone like DG does what he does, that's just my story. That makes what's bottled up come straight forward and it fills me with emotion. Makes me sad. Doesn't make me angry. This makes me sad. It makes me think about the family member. It brings my emotions out. And that's just my one snippet of it. There is people who have offspring who are severely disabled. There's people who are end of life. There's, there's people that can't control the way they speak. They can't control the way they eat or they move you have offended everyone who looks after someone like that everyone who has a family member that is in that situation and everyone who is in that situation people use this app as a safe place you have carers which come on here after a long day just to take the mind off stuff. You have brothers or sisters of people who suffer from this stuff, who just sit on here because they want a little escape from reality. And you throw that shit out here. You, you basically laugh at it. And when someone wants an apology off you, i.e., uh, I don't know what she's got, Nisha, she jumps in the box later. I think she's called Nisha. Nisha had the same situation. She had a family member who suffered. All she wanted was an apology. Doesn't make it right. Doesn't make it any better. But it sort of seals a wound. An internal wound that has been opened. And all DG could say was, sorry, you're offended by it. Yeah, man. Got the right to respond to this, but that with Darren, um, I've never I seen. Know, I don't. I don't miss Red won't um, say anything because she told me. Tony, tell me what exactly happened about that when you were saying. Basically, it. Darren, but Darren was in the box. I'm going to yeah, skip this Darren so far. I'm just going to skip till he when put DG on a gets in. The filter that DG did that made his that made. And how they have in the the world. The Tarasco. Isn't that in his ass? The TikTok. Yeah. Oh, boss, go away. There's a lot of what names at all. Not to call anybody out. Anybody. It's DG no, already jumped in. You were saying oh, that yeah. about him. Listen, oh. you're in the box. About a little fucking sheep. Oh. Hey, DG. Hey, DG. Hey, DG. Good evening. Go back. What's the crack, DG? That, that I then they come up and I just wanted to explain. I, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. DG to come and ex obviously extremely offensive. I've heard other people saying this was nice what this was done and that.
of anybody can evil queen just mentioned at the beginning it says responsible for me sab but that there would have triggered that, 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 but that today yeah yeah so wall said so on that and wall said opal people is a tiktoker on me see then opal where is where am i going Yeah, I'm asking a simple question. I have gone, I no, do... have I gone at over a disability? Have I gone I'm at... asking a simple question. Are you going to bring the rest of them in that also has the same sort of shit with Darren? That's all I'm asking you people. Why are you all going? You all going for one person. It's one person that's been called in this court. Somebody mentioned the video. I haven't seen the video. But this ain't, not, this ain't a courtroom and this ain't the House of Commons. Exactly. You're calling out exactly. one person. Can you please call out the rest me. then? How about you call out the rest rather than just go for one person? You I lot are fucking annoying. Nobody. You ain't got a shout out. Nah, because you lot are annoying. Nobody You're annoying. So You're fucking destroying this app with your bullshit 24 7. Call out everybody if you're going to go for them. How? How? Go for one person. So nobody's gone for anybody. So there you go then. Bro, this whole thing is a witch hunt. You're all going. Paul, can I just show you a, uh, a video from HSC? You can talk out about box. a video that's getting showed on here. Never mind, yes, J. Crew. When have I gone for uh, DG? When have I gone for him? I didn't bring this up. Nobody bring this up. Uh, sorry, I didn't bring this up. Somebody else fetched this up. And when I said. Listen, if your voice does not match that echo chamber, <laughs> you ain't staying in there. No way. Right, here we go. Let me just skip to this part. That's In the box. A little fucking sheep. Hey, DG. Hey, DG. Hey, DG. <laughs> hey, DG. Hey, DG. Hey, DG. <laughs> am I the only one seeing this? Am I... Do I need to take my glasses off for this? This is insane. Hey, did you? Hey, did you? Hey, did you? Let's just get a rewind on that. For him. And then Jay comes in like that, like a raving lunatic. DJ. So now Jay Crew, I really mean it. Fuck off. Can you bring uh, DJ up for in the box? Wow, a little fucking sheep. Here we go. Hey, did you? Hey DG. Hey DG. Good evening. Good evening. The They're all clicked up. Explain that comment that you made, DG, about DG. Let me give you Wait some Wait a minute. Content. Hold on a minute. Giving back. If DG's coming, just let him talk because I'm a bit. To be fair though, I think this guy in the middle uh, goes DG, in. So, big so up. I've been around the app today, and there's a clip going around. Obviously, I'm FYP. I've posted it. It's not my clip. It's um, King Clips or something. But anyway. Agent fucking Scully. FYP. Who the fuck does she think she is? I'm FYP, mate. Do you want to come with me? Got a few questions. <laughs> Grab your rucksack and fuck off. No one knows the context of this clip. So, is anybody jumping at you? We're all like, we need Gigi to come in here and explain what it's about. So, have you um... seen the clip? Have you seen yeah, it? Yeah, 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 I saw it, yeah. Gigi, yeah. Whatever J. Crew's told you and everybody in the comments will tell you, I was sticking up for you. I said, you do all <laughs> kinds. <laughs> oh, my. What do we have here? I have missed. I have missed this. I have missed this part. <laughs> Good song. I was sticking up for you. <laughs> These are the same people. These are the people which are running FYP pages. The non bias. I was sticking up for you. <laughs> Get a fucking grip. Listen. 
listen, people were coming in, Evil Queen coming in and said, you've heard that he's given to the homeless. I said, I've got lots of people. You do lots of things behind the scenes for disabled people. I said, now I'm very shocked if he's meant it in that way. That's what I was saying. And then all of a sudden, J. Cruz. <laughs> oh, box friends. <laughs> oh, box friends. My send your universe friend. <laughs> Goes to Benny Dorm friend. Fuck off. Fuck me. I've seen some arse kissing in my time, and this is on another level. This is on another level. Come in, and who are you to fucking demand DG? I didn't demand you here. I was sticking up for you by saying, Whoa, everybody, we're going off a cliff. Let DG speak. Yeah, let him have his He knows what he does. She set a live up. Her cliff analogy. Your cliff analogy was shit. I'll tell you another analogy, what you've done, and I'll integrate your cliff analogy into it. You've set a line up alive. You've set a live up, okay, and you've dangled on the edge of the cliff with a safety harness on, with a rope. You're connected to the top of the cliff. There's no way, Jose, you were falling off the cliff. And what you've done, you've said to everyone, everyone who agrees that what DG's done is wrong, you said, come on, everyone, <laughs> come on this side of the cliff. No one else has got ropes or safety gear. You're just hanging on. Go on, go on. Push, 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 push. People dropping left, right and centre. Because you've created this environment where only you and your clique can be correct. I've seen quiff again in the comments. Don't let me remind you the powers of this quiff. Okay. This quiff has a superpower. Let me tell you that. It takes a real man to have a quiff. I'd, I've never seen the clip and she, I didn't mention it it was fetched up in the live so you didn't want to be everybody in the comments she was saying that about him listen so. do you want me to turn the comments off so DG can actually no why no, she no, no, no. why no, no, right everybody shush then and well, I'm to my mic so DG can talk Um. so that that, do you know what when I saw the video I thought that's posted in context like it looks like you know I, I know what Karma has posted it looks it looks bad the way he's posted it um, I actually said so my, my context of it was I was in a box and like I said and what I feel like is I feel like I'm speaking to people who just like are away with butterflies like you know they say but and they're like oh yeah like and the, 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 like just the, the t they've not got the intellect to have a conversation they just no matter what facts are shown or no matter what is shown they just they're just so dumb that they can't listen or actually uh, the, basically they, they just they're blinkered they're blinkered and stuff like that so i didn't i, didn't, I, I would never I, I, well. so what he said there what he said there he could have got away with that he could have just said that he could have just said that but what he wanted to do was cause a little bit of harm, I think. I think he wanted someone to watch it from that live and get like a, a punch in the gut for watching it. I think he tried to spin it off with a bit of comedy, but you're not funny. I'm just going to put it out there. You're not funny. At least that's my opinion. I do not find you funny. You're entertaining. You're not funny. What you did was not entertaining, and it certainly was not funny. Well, I'm not, you know, I mean, I would never sit there and go, "Oh, somebody put earlier, uh, he's he's mocking, um, he's mocking autistic, or he's going at autistic and stuff like that." I said, "Yeah, I did say simple, yeah, a hundred percent." I said because they're simple-minded, they are simple-minded. Like, it's like they haven't got a brain cell to themselves. They see facts and they still clutch and go. No, but I don't believe that. Well, well, you don't believe that. It's up to you. But it's it's as you you know you know yourself. You can't talk to stupid, and you, and it's that's the most frustrating thing when somebody you just think, do you not see what 
you know, see you're still happy because what I think it is is the people who are like you know still want to clutch onto this thing with cockapoo and stuff like this and clutch on and say oh, he's trying to is it you okay on the head DG absolute fucking waffle you okay on the head waffle me absolute waffle are you okay on the head DJ Dakar? Yeah, yeah. Clearly. I don't think you fucking are, man. I'm a disabled man and I'm listening to your waffle and it's absolutely pure and not the Exactly. Bullshit. He's trying to justify his wrongdoings. Absolute fucking yeah. fun. And if you said it, just say, yeah, I said you it. Are. I put my you hands are. up. I said it. I'm a dickhead. You? I said it. I s- Why are you fucking I said what? trying to make what excuses did I say? for it? What did I say? You fucking mocking people who are disabled. You are then said that, 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 that. Pearl's gone awfully quiet. Dumb as well, just now. And then you're, yeah, you're on here definitely. trying to make excuses about well, that DG Dakwa. I, I know. I, if I right, what do you class as mocking a disabled person? Because me, I, I see what mocking you did a disabled last person. night. What that's what I did in my kit. It's about Darren. What's that's it about? Ooh, about no, Darren. it's not about oh. Darren. Ooh, butterfly. That's well, mocking. He's just been in Tony official and said. That uh, it's not the first time somebody else won the box. Tony Fish will come and say it wasn't the first time. You know, big up Evil Queen and big up Tony and big up G Crew for what you three have done before this has happened. Because no one else has the backbone in this live to do it. And Pearl will not just let anyone up in the live. Pearl let EQ up because. Pearl sees EQ as a bit of clout and numbers in a room. Pearl let G Crew up because Pearl sees G Crew as a bit of clout and a bit of numbers in the room. She was not expecting G Crew's backlash and she was probably partially expecting Evil Queen's backlash, but not at that extent. Tony as well. Big up Tony. Tony jumped in. Tony asked for the poll first, seeing what the room was up to. And then went at it. That's how it should have been. Each one of these people in here, bar these two which are talking now, should have done this from the start. This Alfie guy, I don't understand what he's doing there. I don't understand. I've seen him a few times now. Lingering. Lingering around these FYP um, biased rooms. Sat there. Talking a lot, but not saying much. So I don't know what his game is. But yeah, big up. Little Darren. Scotch Darren. That sounds nice. Sorry. Yes, oh, one, oh, one the boys, the mocking. mimicking. Listen, it doesn't matter whether G Crew supports Dan or not. It doesn't matter. I don't give a shit who supports who in that moment in that situation that was the correct thing to do a grown adult right you can't see what you did was wrong then you need to give your head a wobble nah, oh, you, you need to give your head a wobble mate you know what it is yeah, sure app, it is, app is sure it is. So got, sure do you want to just <clears throat> quieten down a little no bit? fucking no, won't no won't Not girl, no, won't. Like no girl. won't little girl Oh. Can I say something without talk away, over talking me, please? Um, Angie, we're no, over talking. You're always over talking. Can you mute her? Oh, Can you just drop her? Else I'll come in to explain. Just drop her. Just drop her. Oh. I'm not going to sit here and I, I, I'm, I'm not going to sit here and explain her because she's she's so like right. she's so. So what I think's happened here, and I could be wrong. I've said it in the past, and someone's like cleared it up and said it didn't happen. But I generally think this happened now, and you might be annoyed at me, but I'm just going to rewind this. I'm not going to play it from the rewind, but I'm just going to show you one single part of it. And this is my analysis on the situation. Let me just, what, where are we at here? 46.22. Let me just go back a little bit. Um, not there. Was it here? Um, so, so watch... It might not be here, but I have seen it. I'm not I'm not willing to play it all the way through. This is just my opinion on the situation. Watch the mannerisms of Pearl here. She keeps looking down. She keeps looking to this corner. And I'm thinking, why? Why are you looking there? Is the Ten Commandments tablet there? Possibly. Um, 
Have you seen yeah, it? Yeah, 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 I saw it, yeah. yeah. Whatever J. Crew's told you, and everybody in the comments will tell you, I was sticking it. It might be figure. before this. I said, you do all yeah. kinds. Even if, listen, we're going on. Um, so that... Yeah. That, do you know what? When I saw the video, I thought that's posted in context. Like it looks like you know she's, like, she's on. I, posted, it looks. It looks. This bad, is my opinion here. I think she's on another device, and my opinion is she's probably speaking to Angie. I said this before, and Angie come out and said, "Listen, we don't talk behind the scenes." I think that she's contacted Angie here to say, "Listen, jump back in the box because DG's getting it." And Angie's jumped in and obviously back the corner of the person that she wants to send her gifts at 8 p.m. That's my opinion. I could be wrong. It's not factual. But from what I'm seeing, what I'm analysing, I think that could be a plausible theory. I'm going to go back to where we were. Um, I actually said, so my, my context of it was I was in a... Girl, more like girl. No, won't. Little girl. Oh. Can I say something without Top Girl over talking me, please? Um, Angie, I won't no, over talking. You're always over talking. Can you mute her? Oh, Can sure. you just drop yeah. her? So and Angie's, Angie's now. Please. Just drop her. So Pearl wasn't willing to allow G Crew to stay up because G Crew went against the grain. Okay. Pearl wasn't allowing anyone to jump up which went against the grain as soon as dg starts getting backlash for what he's done people are actually talking facts here they're not trying to slander him they're talking facts about what he's done surprise surprise angie's in the box angie's straight there i'm not going to sit here and I, I, I'm not going to sit here and explain it because she's, she's so like, she's so, it doesn't matter what you do, just you please can't just drop me. it and I'm explaining. You can't me. There you go again, Top Girl. You can come back. Two minutes, no, you can come back. That's it. Bye, little girl. Um, that, so they've took someone out of the box now who was fighting, which I I want to say the correct corner against DG. They've removed her. They've silenced her. Listen, there's one thing you can't do to me is silence me. That's one USP I've got. But what's happened? They've silenced her. I don't know whether she has a platform where she can go live herself and talk about stuff. But in this essence, they've silenced her and replaced her with a teammate of DGs. <laughs> Couldn't make it up. Don't do that, DG. Yeah, but that's so. What I'm saying is that that's what I'm saying. I, I class mocking as if, if I was sat there laughing at somebody who's disabled or whatever. Like so it's like yeah. I'll put it this way, right? And, 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 and I bring this reference. I bring this reference numerous times. So would you say Andy Pipkin? Yeah, on Little Britain. Um, right. This reference he's going to do now about Little Britain and Andy Pipkin. He's going to say, like, do you think Andy Pipkin is mocking disability? Okay. One. Yes. Yes, he is. Two. The time in which Little Britain was aired, okay, it wasn't acknowledged as a bad thing. It was in a comedic environment. So people weren't, people were disgusted with it. Hence, why Little Britain is no more, because they cannot get away with it anymore. They can't get away with it anymore. So yes, Andy Pipkin, or whoever it is, was mocking a disabled person. At the time, people were laughing at it, but there was a hell of a lot of people which it upset. Hence, why Little Britain did not carry on. Okay, so your analogy... When you're saying everyone's stupid and everyone's simple, grab a mirror, please. Okay? Because I'm not fucking stupid and you're not going to pull any wool over my eyes or the people watching with me. Is mocking disabled people, would you say, is, and like, is that... That's what, not real you, life, though. Uh, oh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. There you go. That's real life. That's real life, so what you're saying is people on TikTok are snowflaking. Oh, God. No, people on TikTok have got disabilities and you need... 
This word snowflake as well. Can we just fucking sizzle this snowflake out of heat? Why is everyone who's affected by a situation a snowflake? Why are you putting people in this category of snowflake? Maybe have the snowflake category for some if you're talking about a situation which is light. If you're talking about football or something and you say, oh, this football team's great, this football team's rubbish, and the people who support the rubbish team, if they're like, ah, oh, yeah, it's a bunch of snowflakes. But don't use the snowflake term for everyone which is affected by something because there's a massive spectrum of situations. What you've done, you've caused damage to people who are this high up on that spectrum. But you're... You're grabbing them and saying they're a snowflake and putting them in the same category as someone down here. Incorrect. Again. And again, get a mirror, please. You didn't keep your mouth shut. And people in real life haven't. Can I just quickly have my say and then I can jump out? Well, I mean, I, I, stand with G, I stand with GG on this one. I think it's ridiculous. You know, I, I say that... Nah, you stand with your fucking wine bottle as can well. I just, Shit. No, 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 I, I wasn't nodding. Quickly. Um, I, you know, I... I wasn't... Sorry, I wasn't nodding at the wine bottle part there. I don't think you should... Obviously, don't bring up any... If someone's an alcoholic or someone has a problem with drink or they use it to um, cure... Um, a problem they've got. No, no, don't don't throw it at them. I didn't. I didn't know I was going to say the the wine bottle. Then I was. I thought it was going to say you stand by another crater or something. <clears throat> but like I said the other night, anyway, with Angie, her lives are drama lives. Remember that. Any situation you bring into Angie's life is a drama situation. Once it's in that ecosystem, so she's going to say everything opposite and what everyone else is going to say. I don't know whether she truly believes what she's saying here. She might think she's going to get a gift out the back of it or she might think, oh, I'll tell you what, I'll fire up a live later and all the people that disagree with me are going to jump in and watch me. Because what, what's that What's that phrase? Um, oh, what is it? <sighs> Shit. God, my mind went blank. Um... Where you get views on a sit, I can't think what the, the word is for it. Where you get views on a situation, doesn't matter whether it's good or bad, the views are still views. I can't remember the full thing for it. But yeah. I say the word simple all the time. I say the things, I do the things that DG uh, does all the time. I think a lot of the people on here are simple. Um, I'm not mocking, dis you know, dis uh, disabled people at all. I think it's, you know, we've become such a woke society. I don't even think we've become a woke society. I think we've become a woke TikTok. Yeah, that any attention is good, in, that good attention. Thing, but what everyone is doing is they're saying this is how disabled people are. This is how, uh, you know, this is what a disabled person looks like, you know. Um, and that's not the case. I mean, the people that are criticizing DG are the, are the people that are criticizing, you know, disability in some ways, because I don't see uh, a disability in that way at all. That was a powerful statement you just done. Not positively powerful, negatively powerful. You just said everyone who's offended by what DG's done is just as bad. What can I let me go back on that? Able people are. This is how you know, this is what a disabled person looks like, you know. Um, and that's not the case. I mean, the people that are criticizing DG are the if you're imitating someone who has cerebral palsy and you're putting a voice on for someone who suffers with some sort of vocal disability or some something's causing them to speak in a certain way and you're doing them both together then you are imitating someone who's disabled and you're not doing it for the right reasons are you, you you're doing it for a laugh or you're doing it out of spite so you're incorrect on that section angie you are incorrect the people that are criticizing you know disability in some ways because i don't see uh just and to top it off you said the people who think that dg's wrong are also criticizing people's disabilities 
responsibility in that way at all. I mean, you know, get a grip, guys. You know, half the people are. They're so stupid. You know, it's like I'm constantly explaining things to people over and over again, and they just don't get it. And I do say, oh, my God, please, you are so simple. But I'm not mocking anybody when I say that. Our old hands are comedians. They don't. You just said, I will say the same. But do you know what's the matter with this app? Pearl's agreeing, obviously. Tag team. (laughs) Pearl's all for it. Come on, DG. Come on. (laughs) Unbelievable. Don't say anything because now everybody jumps over everything. Look how I always call myself backwards. Somebody said to us the other day, you can't say that, you're mocking disabilities. Listen, I was calling myself backwards, right? And then everybody jumped all over us again from that. I can't say for calling, sir. I mean, I do that. Can I just say, Pearl, from from the date? You You have to be very careful what you say on this app. Very, very, very careful. If you say something in private, that's a different matter. In some ways, you can say what the hell you want in your own house to people who are in your house, family, whatever. You can discuss any matter. You can say any name, anything you want to do. You can do that. But as soon as you come on to here and click a live button, you've acknowledged that there is guidelines for one. Okay, those guidelines are there for a reason. Number two, there's a lot of people watching you. There's a lot of situations these people are in. So you've got to be squeaky clean. Squeaky, squeaky clean. With what you say. I I met DG he first joined me when he first joined the app. Yeah. And he was actually pretending to be like, there was something up with him. And I got banana for 10 days. So I've never been a person not to watch DG after that mm. because it, I was affected because I've got a disabled son and he couldn't seem to understand how I was so affected by what he was doing. But it was very, very triggering and very hateful to watch that. And, and then even to watch him blow up afterwards. And it's like, he's got no consideration for how other people feel from what he does. Can and I just ask you a quick question? It might not, um, it might not be you... intentional for him to make us feel like that. But when he knows that it does, then there should be a line where he goes, okay, well, this is going to affect people in this way. And, you know, I, I'm not going to do that because, you know, I've realised people are affected by it. Well, maybe, you know I mean? maybe DJ's done DJ's done this a few times and he's probably not real. And I'm not defending. Not no, that's what I mean. That, that's why I'm saying now. Well, have you ever not seen can no, I ask you a question? Do you ever not do it? Say uh, you're uh, you're uh. I've seen, I've heard I see people do that all the time, uh, like that kind of thing. No, it's I, mocking. It's, it's, personally, it wasn't a, 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 what what he done. He was physically acting like he was severe disabled. Uh, no, oh, it was actually I remember what it was. It was Tourette. So it, it, it wasn't. It, it wasn't. Severe, it, it wasn't. It wasn't me acting severely disabled but even, so even was... to say you're acting like Tourette so my son's got autism and Tourette is a form which falls under autism so a child that's got autism and it can be an adult that's got it and they have tics it's called so not not so much Tourette but tics so again DJ it can affect people in other ways so even that so Tourette Tourette is a disability right so that's another disability still even though it might not be you know, to me, that's quite a severe disability when they're taken like that. So, yeah, that's why I took it. So, but it wasn't just so much the threat you was going in because I, 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 I literally felt like I was, I wanted to get down the screen pale because I thought, and I'm, a vis, I'm vocally telling him, nah, you're wrong, I've got a disabled. And he carried on and on. He then told all his people to go and report me, right? And I was banned for 10 days, so I couldn't react to him. Because we went, as soon as I got banned, we went to his life and he was- I'm going to just uh, intervene here for one second. What, what she's saying is completely true. Well, I just want to side note something. I think a lot of these creators, the bigger creators, don't like me because I bring like voices like this lady's up there. 
they they don't have any backlash from what they do. They don't have any backlash. They've been getting away with so much for so long. Some people have highlighted it, but it just here today, gone tomorrow. It's what it is, swept under the carpet. DG will tell everyone I have an agenda. I have this, I have that, I'm on air for money. I'm on air for the leaderboards. Yappy yappy yappa. Not the case. Not the case. I'm here to highlight the issues which creators create. Okay? When there's vulnerable people getting taken advantage of. I'll just highlight it. If you don't like it, or if you're kicking up a fuss, the shoe must fit. The shoe does fit most of the time. I'm not just here to talk about DG. Okay? But he keeps popping up on the radar. And unlike Pearl, and unlike Angie, and unlike whoever else, I will highlight it. I am only highlighting things you have done. Remember that. There's no one on this app then. And he was, he's, he's done it from then, <clears throat> from then, from the beginning. He's That's always been a part of what he does. And that's why I'm saying it might not be intentional for them to actually hear people. And that's Can I just, just say one thing yeah. before I drop down, Pearl? Well, um, I, don't I think, think it's you know, fair for the if you're easily, if you're oh, easily offended, if you're easily offended or triggered, come it's on. Not about, it's not about easily being offended. I haven't finished what I'm saying, though. No, I haven't finished my sentence. Hey, let's get trending, Bundy. Do, Bundy yeah, do I'm, I'm, <laughs> this is our big... DG's ego is okay people are already putting bun DG in the chat because they don't like him and he's seen it and he's thought whoa this could be a dent in my ego so what he's then said after seeing that it is trending he said everyone put bun DG in the chat so it looks like he's orchestrated it you haven't people just don't like you okay people don't agree with what you've done the only people that agree with what you've done are die hard DG fans and the likes of Pearl and the likes of Angie. That's it. So if you have 1.5k to 2k people in your live, whenever you're live, they're there, die hard fans. You've done it, you've got the numbers. That doesn't mean every time you go into a live and something's wrong. You can't then get these 1.5k people to all go, Team DG, Team DG. Because you, you just, you're overshadowing actual facts. You're overshadowing victims. You're using your audience as a cloak for your wrongdoings. And they're none the wiser. Half of your audience are the people that I'm trying to protect. Just think about that for one second. Half of your audience, I'm there to try and protect them. I'm not there to remove them from you. I don't care if they're in my life or not. I don't, it doesn't bother me. But I know a lot of them are vulnerable and I'm trying to be there. <laughs> but because of you, they're fighting against me. Think how messed up that is. You're using your influence for the wrong reasons. Uh, trend, trend it. Trend if, you're, if you're affected or triggered, come off TikTok. It's probably not the place for you, number one. And number two, I think a lot of people, they don't really give a shit what DG has said. They're, they're doing it for attention, clout, and the views, and all of that yeah. kind of stuff. I don't think you really give a shit. I really don't. I don't think you I just think you've, think you've, you've got that mentality, Angie, because your platform might a bit big. Do you know what I mean? So you think on there, you think everyone's looking for clouds and everyone's, for, everyone's not looking for what you look for from this app. And that's where you need to take a back seat and stop getting above yourself and remember who and what you are away from the app. Because we're all the same. Just because, just because you've had more, more, more views doesn't make you any better. 
What I couldn't get over with DG was, right, he does all kinds behind the scenes. What He doesn't mention what I've heard through the grapevine. Correct us if I'm wrong, DG, but he does all kinds, and it's more for... I get that, and, and maybe it's, it's, it's not a big thing. You don't have to boast about what you do on the app. Oh, exactly, and he doesn't. He doesn't. And that's why I was shocked to think, oh, right? But sometimes that's guilt as well, Pearl. Like doing, maybe, all that, maybe doing all that, maybe yeah, like doing all that. What he's doing is that is that a guilty thing? Because how he's made no, people feel. I'm not like guilty for anything. I see the homeless thing. What he did with Ben, hats off to him for that because he, like he said, he's being homeless himself. So he 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 regulated to that, and you know that. And, and what he did for Ben was was really good. Do you know what I mean? And that's what I'm saying. I don't personally think DG is someone that goes out and personally targets people for these reasons but you've got he's got to take into consideration that people are affected by what he's doing and what he's saying the best best thing anyone can do on here right is instead of if you get something pulling it up going look at this look at this what 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 everyone tries to do on here because there's gifts on here and tries to tries to push something to go look what he's like look this is him this is it blah 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 yeah. If if uh, uh, your best thing is and you won't get triggered, you've got a fucking you've got two thumbs. Yeah, if you don't like it, fucking swipe up. If you do I like it, said, yeah, don't what? Don't and get I, if you're awesome. because you know if you take everything personally in yes. life and you take everything to serious and you think everything's attacking you and you think everything's about like you know it's oh but I've got this person in my life I've got this person yeah, but in my like life. me personally, I, that's what I'm saying. I'm not going off what you've said and done. Does he understand what influence is? Do you think he understands what influence is? If he said something as mad, if any of these big creators say something as mad as the skies, what colour could the sky be? The sky's orange. There's no blue. The sky's always orange. Maybe 90% of people say, is it fuck? And laugh. 10% will be like, Probably is orange. If he said it, it probably is. If he says, buy this t-shirt, it's got this on it. A lot of people are going to buy it. If he says, go to this place for food, it's really good. If you're in the area, maybe a lot of people go to it. He has influence over people. But I don't think he knows how to harness it in. I don't think he knows how to harness it in. Now, his channel was built up. By doing pranks, yes, but also dressing up as other creators. So when he sees people like Dead Wings, again, as an example, he sees Dead Wings as a threat. He'll see Dead Wings as a threat now because Dead Wings is doing his thing, he's doing all right with it, he's slowly getting bigger and bigger and bigger until the point where he'll be, whoosh, he'll be up there. Obviously, he'll be up there. So it works, isn't it? But DG will mention Dead Wings in his life in a negative way. He'll say something about him or does something to put it down, something to dampen what he's doing. And because he has influence, out of the thousands of people that watch him, there's going to be a few hundred which take it on board and have it as ammunition. And they'll go over to Dead Wings Live and say, you're pathetic, you're this. You'll never be whoever. He's not in control of his influence. Remember that. With anybody else, I'm going from my personal experience and you personally done it to me. So yeah, I was really affected by what you said because me personally, you said it to me, I've got a disabled son and I thought you was very, very disrespectful what you did. My... My I'm little, not going off what you've said with Darren or anything, what the, what I've listened in Pearl's live today. I'm going off personally what you did and what you said and how you acted to me. So to, to turn around and say, don't be affected. Who are you to tell people what to be affected by and what not to be affected by? You shouldn't be doing them things. You're a grown man. You've actually got a child yourself. And maybe if you had a disabled child, you would feel the same way. But... Luckily, your child's not got a disability, so you wouldn't you wouldn't think along them lines. I don't know, but to turn around and say to someone, you don't be affected, or if you are, just x out. No, no, not at all. No, don't be that have your say, dis- disrespectful to people. Have your say. Jump in a box and everyone go on about it for weeks.
equally. Um, why? Jesus. Wrong accent, come on then. Why Why is he imitating uh, this lady's voice? So why, why is he talking to that level now where he's actually imitating the voice? This lady is speaking of passion. She's speaking of a situation which is very close to her heart. And instead of having empathy, he's just mocking it. So he's doing mocking it. Just mock it. Mock it, right? This is the first thing I've just mentioned, and it, it, Once, it actually, a year ago, you've never heard me speak about it before we'll about until it just now. It was probably about going on about it no more. I didn't bring it to my page today, and it was somebody else, and it started getting talked about, and that was the whole point why I said, "Well, hold on a minute." Somebody shared the slide to DJ. I said, "He's the only one that knows he was there to say what context this was in, because we all know how dangerous fucking clips are." Yeah. Do you know what, what I'm saying? There's 3,700 people in this live right now and whatnot. Every single one of them can 100% hand on their heart, turn around and not say that they've they've been completely 100% political correct in their entire life. I think 1 million percent. No. Yes. Are these, are these like forgetting that they're pressing pressing a live button they've got the phone or the device they've gone onto live they've actually gone onto the TikTok app okay unlocked the phone gone onto TikTok scrolled over to live and they pressed the live button now the phone's in front of them and they've said something there's a difference there's a difference between saying it like this and saying it in your front room where there's no cameras on, there's no recording, it's not live streamed. So yes, everyone probably has said something which would offend someone at some point in their life. It's about not doing it on a live because you are influencing other people to do that as well. You're making other people think it's a correct thing to do. It's as simple as that, Alfie. So in future, keep your mic on mute because no one's asked about what you're saying, mate. So there's listen, a difference from, I, there's a I difference have, from being an entire writer your entire life to making the same mistakes over and over again because it does become personal then, doesn't it? And it does become like it's, you know, that that's just the type of person that they are when you do it over and over again you can set, do a mis you can do something it's a mistake you apologize for it you move on you don't do that same mistake again but when does it when when does it stop so let's say that dg now turned around and said listen yes i did say that i'm sorry if i've offended someone when does that stop them when does then that's what i mean if dg apologized and and that that should be it when someone apologizes if the she's correct he's clueless if dg said Listen, guys, I'm sorry for what I said. Let's take it on the chin. It's what it is. I shouldn't have said it. It's not a correct thing to do. Uh, if anyone's watching, don't do it on a live because it's not good because it could affect... It could affect these people by doing this. That's that's all that needs to happen. That That's it. That's it. I don't give a shit whether he's got intentions to do it again next week or the day after. I don't give a shit. If he does it, I'll be there again to highlight it. I can't stop someone from doing something. You can never prevent someone from doing something. Okay? But what you can do is try and lead them in the right direction. Enforce a little bit of morals. So for Alfie, I'm guessing you're watching on a cam two or something. All right, for it to end, and this goes to every creator which has done something wrong. If you've manipulated someone, if you've taken advantage of someone who's vulnerable, I cannot stop you from doing that. If that's what character you are, you're going to continue to do that. But when a mistake is highlighted, okay, to prevent someone continuously talking about it, just say, I am sorry. I should not have done this. Okay? And if anyone who is influenced by me thinks this is a correct thing to do, 
it is not. I made a mistake. That's all anyone has to do, okay? I've spread awareness. You've acknowledged the wrongdoing, and by apologising, you have let other people know, the audience know, that it is incorrect and people should not do it. Job done, book closed, my 1030 is gone. It's as simple as that. As simple as that. But what you get on air is deflection, people sticking up for people. Everyone wants a receipt. Where's the receipt? Where's the receipt? Just acknowledge it. Accept it. Take it on the chin and say you're sorry properly. That's it. But if, this, if that person apologises and goes and does the same mistake over and over again, then really and truly the first apology isn't really counted for, is it? Because he wasn't sorry. That's like okay. sorry, not sorry. Uh, it's like a I'm sorry. When do you do I'm it sorry again? people are offended by me. He's not saying sorry there. He's saying sorry that the same sorry Mama Kaz did. The same sorry Miss Red did. It's like the ego sorry. Hello, I'm the ego. I'm sorry you feel that way. But that, are you, are you saying that in a sarcastic way? Or no, is that no, I'm sorry like, people are offended by me. It's not, it's not for everybody. I'm not for everybody. I'm not for everybody and I understand that, but I'm sorry. I, I personally think that you're affected by certain creators. Certain creators. Certain creators. back the matrix is trying to take me down here hang on we're back um what was i saying yeah this fyp channel what she's called tezza fyp she's just agreed with dg if you don't like it to scroll don't like it to scroll so the situations in which she's saying if you do not like this just scroll away if you're triggered by this just scroll away is the same clips and situations she'll be posting and trying to hit the fyp with she wants these posts to hit the algorithm so everyone sees it but what she's saying is if you don't like it in this person's live, the scroll, but she's publishing it. <laughs> ah, good chit chat. Where's my mouse gone? There it is. It was 18 months ago, and that 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 was it. It, it. I got banned. That was that. I've I've never gone into DG's live. I've that's been that. I don't go on TikTok and talk about DG because it's all in the past. But when I've just been here and, and I've heard then, obviously it's a repetitive thing and it's happened more more than just a couple DG, of times. DG, it's Karma Kaz. Are you all right with him there. coming in? No, I don't like that. Clock that's, clock that's why I've got like that. <laughs> Look at Pearl's face. She's buzzing. Christmas has come early. Oh, Pearly Whirly. Let's see what we can do with you. I'm not going to use the marching music. What can we... I think we'll just go on to Bingu again. This week on uh, Pingu Pearl. <laughs> nod nod. <laughs> Pearls fell into a well again. Nod nod. <laughs> nod 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 nod. <laughs> They're all in the box, a bunch of penguins. Nod 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 nod. <laughs> oh, Pearl. <laughs> 
Oh, God, I bet it sucks that I'm on the app. <laughs> but it sucks that I've been erased from the depths. I am now here comfortable. And I'm fucking going nowhere. <laughs> It obviously becomes it becomes <clears throat> don't, don't let that nobody in. He's, he's he's trying to gain a fucking platform off everyone else. Leg it, you little clout chaser. <laughs> Leg it. <laughs> But ain't we oh. all trying to get a platform? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, Alfie Walfie. Did that tickle your funny bone? <laughs> Did the big creator tell a joke and you found your moment to... <laughs> oh. Alfie the Walfie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Alfie. Piss off. <laughs> so, oh, on this app. Yeah, maybe everyone is trying to get a platform, but it doesn't oh, like, like that's what I mean. People no, don't need to get a platform off like the back end of but, Slag and DG off or Slag and Pale off. Do you know what I mean? Well, like, DG doesn't want him in. Him in. Like, he doesn't need to be people. I don't like Mama Cats because he just, comes in just and just his name before he was. Yeah, so I'll tell, you, I'll tell you. Listen, before I turn this miserable app on, before I installed it on my phone, okay, before I spent many years grinding away on this app in different realms, I didn't know who the fuck you were, Pearl. I only knew who you were, Pearl, because of your racist comments. Okay, you only know who I am because I'm trying to spread a little bit of awareness and you don't like it. 